Hi guys, it's Arsha and welcome to my first ever podcast series called Our Universe. So the reason why I've named it Our Universe is because I believe and everybody knows that the universe is holistically everybody's but personally yours. Now, what this means is that I call guests on to the show and I personally do episodes where we talk about how the universe helps you, how it's about you, your spirituality, your individuality and why human beings do the things that we do, the human experience in comparison to the spiritual experience and so much more. And the reason why I'm also doing this is because I really just I really just want to talk man. I just want to talk to people. I just want to have deeper conversations and I want to have more fruitful conversations and I feel like a podcast helps you do just that. Also since I started my spiritual journey, I've kind of realized the need for women in specific to step into their divine feminine energy because that would just make our lives as women so much easier and when i say that it just sounds so airy fairy like what is she saying what is the divine feminine energy so if you continue watching this podcast and if you're with me for a while then hopefully we can tap deeper into subjects like women stepping into their divine feminine as feminine energy and even men actually for that matter and just making the human experience a little more easy because it's not always easy but there's always lessons to learn and there's always things to share and i'm here for just that i also feel like in today's day and age the matrix is kind of built around inducing anxiety everybody knows this it's just designed in a way to make human beings more anxious and in turn more dependent you wake up in the morning you open your cell phone you read a bad news there you're anxious you go to work your boss tells you something because you did not meet a deadline that was or a false sense of urgency created there again you're anxious then you're hungry you eat processed food you eat meat again you're anxious i'm not anti meat by the way i just i kind of just said it like that only but basically the food you consume the content you consume the people you surround yourself with they all holistically determine the way your life is it they holistically determine the quality of your life and so in order to be less anxious as individuals i feel like there are so many steps that we can take towards spirituality towards mindfulness to just live an easier life and to ignite conversations based on subjects like this is not only helpful to me but also helpful to you guys that are watching this podcast is more like a passion project it's more for me than for anybody else but of course in the journey if there's people watching then that would just be amazing because that's us sharing our light to you another reason why i'm so keen on starting this podcast is because ever since i turned to spirituality i feel like life got better for me i understood my triggers i understood why i behave in the ways that i do i focused on improving myself there was a sense of stillness in me which i kind of had not experienced before there was a sense of um you know surrender like surrendering to the universe for all that is all that was and all that is yet to come i feel like when you start a spiritual journey and you're you know it's obviously hard to kind of learn the lessons of forgiveness and surrendering and all of these words sound so heavy and yes people talk about it all the time but in the real world in actual real time how easy or how hard it is to practice surrendering and to practice forgiving forgiveness sorry so it is not easy right but it is still a process and i feel like through regular spiritual practices through sadhana meditation just being in knowledge these things come more easily like, all of these profound yet simple concepts you are able to imply them with a little bit more ease in your day to day life and to acquire knowledge from the world is amazing and it's the only way and so if i have people on board if i have people on this podcast that kind of share their experiences on forgiveness on surrendering and just even fun stuff for that matter spirituality is not just dark and sad you know 
being a spiritual person is quite a big part of my existence personally so very authentically if i were to have conversations with people in my day to day life then we do end up talking about spirituality in at some point every day there is some point of conversation in my life where i am talking about spirituality and so many of them go unrecorded and i'm like boom like if oh my god if i could share this with the world then that would be amazing so i hope you stick around and enjoy this journey with me